So far, I've been two for two. Remember, I claim it's a good day, it's a good day. Dang, so you can't just be handing out good days, right? Yeah, so let's, 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 do, let's do three for three. That's why I'm here. Why are you feeling me? Why are you feeling me? I'm just saying, that, right? you, didn't, you weren't even legit checking them, you were just checking for size. Like, that's it. Yeah, we got new oh, okay. Is it Magic Johnson? No. Why would you? What? Why? <laughs> what does that? Have? You guys must have had some crazy conversation no, out there. Right? Uh, shout out to Paul Fuentebella from Locust and Wild Honey. He gave us, uh, sold us his iPhone. We got a new case. Ooh, it's wow. pretty fire. Ooh, wow. <laughs> Is it authentic? Or? He said, wow. Yeah, I bought it straight from Nike. Ooh, Ooh that's a clean case. Is it leather? Suede. He saw your shatter backwards and got all excited. Is this the new one? Yeah, it's the new one. How did you like them? Well, I know you're selling them now, but I don't, I don't know. I got my words out of them. Yeah. <laughs> this one's brand new? Yeah. Did you get good news? Let's see, let's see. I got the shatters for 480, but kind of used, little scuffs here and there. Some used turtle doves, 300, brand new's at like five. And then some royal ones, 11 and a half, Benji. You want to trade your shadows? Uh, 250. They're super clean though. Turtles went up. Watch your hands. Watch your hands. Oh, cardboard cuts are really nasty, man. It hurts. Look at all that right here. Was that a good six, seven, eight? Let's just round it up. Say ten, because I still got shoes up here, clothes up here. I think we still have more in the back that we gotta take out. So a lot of stuff to. Oh look, three already done. Oh, those are mine. Oh. <laughs> uh, I bought my first shoe. No. <laughs> I haven't bought any shoes, even though I'm around it all the time. And me and Andrew have been together for almost eight years, and <laughs> barely bought a shoe. <laughs> yeah. What do you think I got? It's something crazy. It's not on that wall. It's an Air Max? It's on this wall. What do you guys think it is? <laughs> I'm not sure. I got this shoe. Oh, I was right. I set the top side. Yeah. <laughs> that one? The yellow one? Yep. <laughs> huh. <laughs> You like these shoes? Do I like it? Yeah. It's gray, white, and blue. Your favorite. <laughs> you just pick these up right now? Yeah. Uh, Kings? Uh, Kings, yeah. So I was mainly trying <laughs> for like a trade for a Yeezy, maybe. Okay. Oh, you can bring Did you have like a price of mine for the dogs? Uh, yeah. Uh, which right now, uh, I'd be like 180. 180 retail. Yeah. Oh, okay, then I'll probably just hold on to these. Then. Okay. Oh dang, they did retail high. Dude. Okay, you, yeah, I didn't. That's so crazy. 160 for some dumps. I mean, they're nice. What do you guys think? Is 160 retail so high? I mean, it, it's some pretty good quality. Feels nice. But. I'm still used to dunks being like a hundred bucks, Me you know, too. like it's so trippy. This one, I'd probably just have to be at retail without the taxes, like 200. Yeah. Okay, I'll probably just hold up. Yeah, yeah, no worries, man. I'm actually looking at one of the, the pure slides. Okay. You guys have like a size 12? I think we might. Let me double check. Yep. Yeah, bone in a 12, I'll check it out. Perfect. Awesome, yeah. Let me ring you up and then we'll take the two credit and I'll uh, catch you out on the rest. Okay, cool. Thank you. First hype shoe. Yeah, like it was like a pair of random Roshis. Like Roshis were like the shoe to get at the time. I think it was like 2012. And I begged my parents. They said, you're crazy if you think I'm going to spend $70 on a pair of shoes. <laughs> Saved up some money and then I bought my first pair of Jordan 1s. It was a Yin Yang. They had like just released. But I regret it because I could have gone the storm blues and everybody knows those go for like 700 now. So, but yeah, good story on my first shoe. Um, the first shoe that I received that really made me become a sneakerhead were the uh, Jordan 12s, the Taxis. Uh, still my top grail of all time. 
and that's what got me to sneakers. <laughs> and now I'm wearing hype stuff, like a hype beast. Hype beast. I'm all supremed out. <laughs> First hype shoe. Oh, the above. Uh, have it right here. Nike 11 Low LeBron Floridian. First shoe I got. This is from Ross back in like 2014, I want to say. Let me see. It's like a month before Christmas. They're doing a little Christmas sale and they had like a bunch of random shoes, right? But that, that one pair caught my eye. I bought that for like 60 bucks. You bought it or your own mom? My mom. I, man, my mom bought it for me. Like 60 bucks. <laughs> Let them know. 60 bucks, but hey, that, that, that shit was lit. I thought I was pimping with that shoe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a cheat and give and give two answers. So uh, one, the very first shoe I remember as a kid getting that was like considered like cool uh, was a pair of Jordan 13 Flints. They were at Foot Locker and I used them to play basketball. So that's one, but I didn't know what that was. But I think the first shoe I knew while getting into like the whole sneaker thing um, was actually a pair of Janowski's in the hay colorway, which actually comes in the blue SB box. And that was the first shoe I actually paid resell on. I bought it on eBay. Yes, Janowski's were reselling in the very beginning. <laughs> very hard to find. Um, but yeah, so that was my, those would be my first pairs right there. How are we doing today? Good, yeah. Are these all pairs brand new? No, I think they're, some of our, some are like barely. Gosh. Gosh. Did Jeff Price is my favorite thing today? Uh, no, I don't. Whatever. Just looking for offers? Yeah. Gotcha. You're a big 11s guy? Uh, no, I just came across them, man. I feel like I might keep these. Gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> these are... Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Nice. Number one. I might keep those too. <laughs> I can do these all together and then just tell me the price for Individual, the for sure. Yeah, because I might want to keep these. But yeah, I understand. They're really good pairs. Yeah. This, so the last pair we took in, mm -hmm. we took it in at $80. Okay. This one is in better condition, so I'd probably be like 100 on this one and probably like 80 on this one, so 180 together. Okay. This one, yeah. So 180 is fine on these two pairs? Yeah, I'm good with gotcha. those. Yeah. You said 210? Yeah. In this condition, I think I'd probably be able to sell it for like 283 in the shop, around there. I mean, they're going for quite a bit, these cap and down. Mm -hmm. so. uh, yeah, I understand. <laughs> yeah. This yeah. is for us, I think I'd price like, it yeah. for like 283. That's yeah. where we price it at. Yeah. I know like market's pretty high out there, but yeah. at the end of the day, we do have to sell the pair, but that's like, I think where we could sell it at. Okay. All right, man. Yeah, for we'll sure, no worries. Gotcha, man. Let me get to pay for this one. If not, I'll come back. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. These are too big for me. Gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> two, four, five, hundred, one, two, three, you four, five, eighty, five, one, eighty. You have like a dollar? Uh, yeah, I'm at, appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Heaters. For real. I'll trade these for some cream SPs any day. Chilling, man. Like, start uh, getting the day started right now, but we're trying to get like a whole bunch of Instagram. Wow. I noticed whenever we post a whole bunch of Instagram pictures, mm -hmm. that's when people start coming in. So I like what we're doing, man. The skits and everything is pretty dope. <laughs> Appreciate that, man. It's, it's all this dude here. He just kind of comes up with the idea, and I just kind of do it. I'm told. So, got you, man. So these have to tax two fifteen with fifty cents. You want to pay cash card today? Yeah, the card sounds too. good. It's gonna pop up there in just one second. Got these concords. They for sure use, but. Look at the good condition that they in though. You feel me? Like, come on now, for only two bills? I mean, that's a pretty still. These over those lottery dunk stuff? Pretty sure it was a good decision, you feel me? So, yeah, man. Shout out Holy Grail. Did you know how much you wanted for this one today? Uh, no. Yeah, no, Anything. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Tom Tax. Size 10 minutes. The sulfur or the. Okay. Any color? You guys I could check for you. Yeah. Did you have any price amount for this one? Mm -hmm. Probably like. <laughs> you do like. 
120. They're going for 120 actually. Okay. What do you think? Probably like 100 flat. You know what then? 105? Yeah. Alright. Appreciate it. Alright, let me get your cash oh, real quick. Actually, uh, if you want to do store credit for the. If we have the Tom Sacks. Yeah. I won't be crazy on it. I'll be like 110 on it. That's what we should have. Yeah, if you guys have it. Alright, guys. So we have. Or a customer's looking for a pair of Tom Sacks, right? Monster Market right now is at 444. So it comes to 485 and 59 cents. Check our website. A size 10 for 420. What a steal, guys. So make sure to check the website and cop because he's getting a steal. This is Mark Nguyen. Checked, man. If you're buying off stock, you're basically paying 494. Yeah. So I dropped off the Racer Blue Dunks that just restocked yesterday. Um, got them for a good price. They gave me a good price. And I just traded them in for store credit towards Tom Sachs, size 10. I hooked it up. They gave a good steal, so always appreciate it. Thank you guys. Yeah, for sure. Check it out, please. These are personals, so yeah, I don't for really sure. care. Uh, uh, probably for this only retail bank at you at 1.30. That's cool. Uh, for the lots, I was at 4.30. Can you do 4.50? Uh, 4.40? Maybe in the middle? I'll go with that. It's like everyone's selling the Union Dunks right now. I know. Yeah, and I'm surprised they're going for what yeah. they are. They were like around like almost 400. Uh, I was at 180 for this one. You do too? I can meet you in the middle again at 190. That's cool. There, can I see the other one? I was at 230 on this one. Perfect. Yeah, That's fine. I'll do that. <laughs> That's exactly what I was thinking. I'm about 40 bucks. <laughs> I could do 50 for you. Oh, okay. Yeah, I appreciate that. Yeah, I was gonna come try to get the, the samples, but yeah, I saw you guys sold it. Yeah. I was like, I was the one week I was trying to get it. <laughs> Alright, so I'm at 1130 Perfect. And for the... Trophy rooms? Yeah, for the trophy rooms, uh, how work about you guys? Uh, like, that's up That's up to him. Yeah. Uh, probably the most we could bro drop it down to is going to be 15 Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. Appreciate it. Yeah. Here's the other pair. I'll check it out. Sheesh. My name's Sean. I am the owner of Crypto Sneaks on Instagram. Came in, dropped off an off-white, some unions, some Mystic Navy, Jordan Low, just some personals also. Just pretty much get rid of them. Got these little bad boys. I added a little bit of cash, but I think to me it's worth it. I appreciate you guys team here at Holy Ground. Definitely big shout out to them. We'll be doing more business here, so definitely appreciate you guys. Yeah, how are you? Good to see you guys. Got some good stuff for me today? I hope. I don't know, you yeah. <laughs> got starter. Did you know how much you want for this one today? Uh, 150? Uh, it's probably the same thing at 120 on this one as well. Okay, I can help you. Uh, 120. You go back to this one. Yeah, for sure. think about it. Gotcha. Yeah. Uh, I'll see. 150. For these ones, we kind of pay back on retail at 130. They're going for around 160. 130? Yeah, 130. I can do that. Want to do that? Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I'm firm at 260. Firm at like 260. I, I know where the payout is. Uh, I'd probably hold off on this one. I think 260 is right at ask. So. Yeah, I was hold. So, uh, yeah, four? You must have the compare. Yeah, I'm going to for this one. Four and a half. Four? Yeah, no uh, I'm at bid. Uh, bid? I think 180. Yeah, I'd be a little far off from where you were at. I'd be at 140 for this one. You, your offer is 140. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's 156 on payout. Uh, yeah, I'd probably just stay firm with my price right now. I don't think we have to be so handy on this series yet. Just, I'd probably just list it then. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I'll hold off. 
I think yeah, I probably would pull off on most of these pairs right here. Okay, so all of them? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Now they're just repeating all over them. Is your personal pairs? Uh, one is, that one, that was the only one left, so. Did you have like the lowest price in my for this Do you guys um, buy shoes? Pay at 260. Yeah, bring them in. What credit? I'll be like at 550. Guys, I don't wear I feel like if I would take these off, it'd be lower than payout. There you go. So you're holding okay, off? Sure. Uh, yeah, just probably. Depending on the I would talk about it'd be like 230. Yeah. 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 Uh, yeah. I guess just see the side. I understand where the bid is, but in, they're going for 550. Okay. That's, Thank you. That's what I'm pricing it at, so. So, uh, I feel like I'd be lower than this one. Uh, what are you thinking? Yeah, I'll just take this iPad uh, for this one. So cool. You want me to add up everything we have right now? Uh, uh, sure. 130 on the Jordan 1s. 150 on the Pandas. 130 on the Dogs. Yeah, we'll pick up a we're at 535. That's cool. So we're at 440 on the Kobe's. Yeah. I think we're at 975 for all. That's, That's cool. cool. For cash or cash? Cash. Uh, did you have anything you're trying to trade towards or find uh, anything? Keep looking around. I know we're really talking about fitness and my wife and I really talking about like fitness my stuff. Family. My bad. I love it. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Here's some macaroons. Thank you very much. Yeah. Alright, thanks for the deal. Alright, Sean. Right. Right. I don't know if I like macaroons. Okay. So Sean's wife came through and cooked us some macaroons. Macarons or macaroons? How do you say it? I think macaroons. You guys can correct us if we're wrong. I just don't like the, the top layer, I just okay. like too hard. You wanna try this, like George? Yeah, hey, y'all about to do. <laughs> <laughs> I'm down. Mmm. Homemade. Yeah. Homemade. Yeah, now this is good. Yeah. The pumpkin spice hits, bro. I stand corrected, this is pretty good. Mmm. Thank soft. you, Sean's wife. I was expecting this Appreciate to be like, really hard. It's really good. Hey, this is. Get these out of my face, I'm gonna eat these all. Ah, for real. Yo, what? I'm glad they didn't have this. Real talk. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The size of 11, but. I need these. I need a deal. Could it make it work? Uh, nah, bro. Honestly, dog. Wait, the shrimps fit good. Mm -hmm. Those fit way too tight, bro. Because those are older. So yeah. They're a little bit more plush. That's why I like the older pairs a lot more. Oh, yeah. People are bringing back in with, a, with more of a bundle. You guys know I like the SBs. I really like these. These are the primitive P Rod SBs. Came out not too long ago. I and mean, it's got like the quilted, like Gucci print design. Like these are this design right here is on the P with the P Rods and it's just like this SB is so good. So, sad it's gonna go away today, but hopefully in the future we make a deal. I'll come them. back with them, bro. <laughs> They do feel a little different. Yeah. Come in store, we'll hook you up on some store credit if you, someone in the comments could uh, name this shoe and no cheating either. Hey, me? Great condition, bro. I know, right? I mean, for, especially for how old it is. Yeah. Like, People sleep on old dogs, dude, I'm telling you, man. Comfier than anything. Oh, yeah, 100%. Thank you so much. Yeah. Enjoy them. Catch you next time. Yeah, I'll be back soon. <laughs> so, I picked up a quick 2007 release. Adding these to the collection. So far, I got 2003, 2004, 2005. Just missing 2006 now. So, wait for him to hit me up when they get an 06 in. And you know what? You guys sleep on these old pairs, bro. These old pairs, the most comfortable dunks ever made, man. Check it out. So, I'm from Honduras, just like my guy right here. So, um, in Honduras <laughs> and like Central American countries, like they send a lot of stuff to these countries like in bulk. Mm -hmm. And so I went to Honduras one time, like when I was in high school and these Kobe's were like sitting. So I paid like 10 bucks no way. for these Kobe's and like beat him into the ground. Dang. And like, 
Yeah. Now they're at Holy Ground. Now, now they're selling for like 180. Yeah, but I'm you sure know. it just kind of went underappreciated. Yeah, yeah, I mean. <laughs> like, yeah, so you, and like you never know, you can find a lot of stuff. Just uh -huh. seeing, especially the vintage, like Sebastian likes the yeah. vintage. Uh, he's picking up some 2017 right. Royals with the tumbled leather on there. Fire. Yeah, no, we just need the Chicago's, so we'll wait until December. Yeah, if, if you want to count that towards the set, which I think I do, like the Chicago counts towards the set, but this is like the all black shoes, like the bread, shadows, and the Royals. I only yeah, have the shadows right now, so I want, yeah. I want to complete the set too. But. I actually got engaged in my breads. Really? Yeah. That's, I mean, the Jordan one looks clean with anything, yeah, so dude. I think it works for yeah. sure. Everyone was doing the 11s for a long time, like yep. for the wedding, but I think it, it looks a little funky. No, no, no. Yeah. I might get rusty for that, but it's cool. Yeah, take that out. <laughs> we can pick up some Yeezys for a good price. You know, you gotta put them on right now. Leave it in. Leave it in. Hell yeah. Is that a holy ground? I just want to see a rare occasion of us both getting called for, for, the put in for my side and said they want to let's change sizes. I was like, okay. <laughs> it looks nice on the feet, I like them. Yeah, they're nice. I put on the orange laces on. Mm -hmm. Our friend who comes in all the time, you guys know him, Steven, is always here. He was yeah. in for the mines before. And he got called for them too. And they messed up. I guess they didn't have the ones that they bought. Oh, they were giving him the Dodger double. They had, uh, yeah. 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 they had someone not show up to that for the dog. Can you imagine? His size. Oh, I'm sorry we gave those away, but here you go. You can have these instead. I was like, <gasps> I would have been like, you guys did me a favor. Oh. Do you guys know how much you guys want for this pair today? You said you're offering us 160 for them? I sent them a message through Instagram. I'm not sure oh, which okay, one you guys yeah, answered. Yeah. Uh, would you mind just showing us the DM and we'll cash yeah. it out? Yeah, that works. All right, let me get your cash real quick. Okay, that's me. Got you guys right here. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60. Awesome. awesome. Thank, Thank you, you so, so much. much. Thank you. What's up, guys? It's Ben's Toy Review. We're going to review these sneakers today. Let's see how durable they are. How are you doing, man? How are you doing? Yeah. I don't see this one too much anymore. Yeah, not too often. Ben, do you know what this is called? Olympic Sevens. Oh, you're asking. Yeah. Me. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> my bad, my bad. I mean, I primarily feel like interested in these three. Um, these ones are kind of just like tough. Um, okay. I could take them in, but it would just be pretty low. Yeah. Um, I'm seeing like really clean pairs selling for about like 140. Uh, I think this one has a few scuffs on it. I'd probably sell it for about 100, so I'd be at like 60 cash. Yeah, that's right. Be like 140 on these. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, these are brand new still, right? Yeah, never never even took it out of the box. I'll actually have to hold off right now. We have like three pairs in the back already okay. the same size. Uh, do you want me still to try and throw you maybe an yeah, offer on yeah. this? Okay. Is this pair brand new as well? Or? You know, a lot of the, the new releases are under retail. I don't know why. Yeah, um, I just think it's just, yeah, the sneaker market is just kind of yeah, it's going down. tanking right now. If I did take these in, it'd just be at 100. That's right. Yeah. How long have you had these for? Um, I think they came out maybe 2014, 2015. Crazy 97 draft day. It's very unique. Got the, I don't know, can you see the reflection go back and forth? Cool. Yeah, and then number eight right here. If you could see it for Kobe. And it's in like Charlotte colorway for draft day because he was drafted first by the Charlotte Hornets. So the 13 inside? Yeah. Yeah, that's for really the 13 pick. That's pretty cool. Yeah. If we did take it in, like I said, this would probably just be like, since it's so like, I would say a little bit more niche and unique, yeah. I'd be pretty low. I'd be at like 40 on them. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Black hats. Probably be like another 40 for these. Yeah, that's fine. I got 40, 80. 
Well, 40, 40, 100. It's like 140 and 60, so 380 right here. I got 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, 40, 60, 82. 20, 40, 60, 83. 20, 40, 60, 380 right there. Okay. But I appreciate the deals on yeah, the other no stuff, man. I'll be back again, I'm sure. Yeah. <laughs> All right, thank you. Yeah, man, it's good seeing you. All right guys, so a quick sneaker tip. This is what you guys as resellers should know before you start buying used shoes, especially older used shoes. So we do have a pair of these Olympic 7s and you know, they're not too bad. They got little scuffs here and there. It's a good classic Jordan. You know, a lot of more OG people are gonna appreciate the shoe. But something that you guys need to know when you guys check stuff like this is, hey man, older shoes, their glue just doesn't hold up. If they're used, the chances of the glue sticking together and bonding is actually very high. That's why most shoes that crumble are actually the ones that are more in very clean or brand new condition. So this shoe being from, I believe, 2012, um, that's 10 years old. So uh, obviously they're worn, but if you guys saw what I was doing when I was checking them, I was pushing against the leather and the midsole to see if there's any separation anything with the glue that's coming undone usually it's like right around the toe cap but as you guys see i'm like pushing a little bit you don't want to be too hard because you can't separate it by force but in this sense this shoe is good to go no separation so that way I, when i sell it to a customer i know it's not going to fall apart on them it's going to be good to go and they just need a good cleaning we could probably repaint a little bit of it but you know i bought this for 60 bucks um, we're probably going to put it up for 80 to 100 just kind of as is no real cleaning or fixing but good classic shoe Oh, whoa, you gotta sling that thing, man. Oh, cut it. Oh, you gotta sling it. Sabrina from Dallas. 